And now from the forewarned storm center, meteorologist Thomas Geboy with weather. After a fairly pleasant weekend with temperatures pretty close to our average today, breaking that mold once again, seeing those temperatures once again, definitely on the hotter side today, getting temperatures into the mid, mid and upper 90s. The some spots today seeing also just a few sprinkles, mainly situated in the northern and northwestern portions of the Wiregrass, like Crenshaw and also Covington County, also seeing a few showers make their way through Pike County just south of Troy. And that's basically what we're going to see throughout the rest of the day as we go to, into the later afternoon hours, basically going to be riding along on the northwestern portions of the Wiregrass. So don't expect to see any rain if you're in Dale or Houston County, but for the most part, if you're in northern Coffee County, you might see a sprinkle here or there, but only a 10% chance of showers throughout the rest of the day. The reason for that is low pressure situated to our south. You get the counterclockwise flow around, around the low pressure, and that's bringing in some dry air from Georgia and it's making its way in here. So you can see just north of that line, that's where we're starting to see those showers begin to fire off. But and we're going to keep these dry conditions. That thing is just going to meander throughout the next 24 hours, and we won't really see that thing move until we get to the mid middle portions of the week when we see rain chances once again increase. But without the rain, that means we'll see temperatures pretty hot. Seeing temperatures right now 94 degrees in Dothan, 95 in Ozark, Blakely and Donaldsville in our Georgia County is coming in at 97 degrees, and Alusia at 99. So. You know, with the no relief from the heat, temperature is still going to be hot, and we're going to keep these hot temperatures at least throughout the next couple hours all the way into 7 p.m. We'll still see temperatures pretty close to the 90 degree mark, not really cooling down until we get close to midnight, where we still will see temperatures hovering right around 80 degrees. So expect another warm and mild evening. Dew point, though, should be relatively on the cooler side. Future cast throughout tomorrow morning, though, shouldn't have to worry about the umbrella going to work tomorrow, going through tomorrow afternoon. We'll see a little bit more shower, shower coverage, excuse me, but going through tomorrow we really won't need the umbrella only about a 20% chance of seeing a shower and most of the shower activity fades away heading into the late evening as we make our way into Wednesday morning and we won't see those shower chances really begin to ramp up until we get to Wednesday. If you can see that little dry slot of air coming in right now, but as we progress further into the week, we'll see a little bit more of influx of moisture and as we head into Thursday and Friday, that's when we'll really begin to see the rain chances ramp up and heading into the weekend looks like about a 50 50 shot of seeing a chance for shower. So won't need the umbrella tomorrow, but as we go throughout the middle portions of the week, you're definitely going to need to grab it. But going into your tropical update, really not much going on. The Atlantic Basin, nice and quiet. Caribbean, nice and quiet as well. And the Gulf of Mexico, really not much going on right there. A lot of shear, so don't expect any development anytime soon. Gulf cast for tomorrow, partly cloudy skies, moderate chance for a rip current. Always be careful getting into the water tomorrow. Should be a pretty nice beach day, two feet on the bays and smooth. So it should be a pretty nice boating day if you choose to do that instead of the beach day. Skycast for tonight, tomorrow, excuse me, partly cloudy skies, high of 97, a little bit cooler in terms of the dew point. So the heat index only going to be around 102 degrees, still hot, but not as hot as we're potentially going to get Wednesday when the humidity ramps back up. Even though the temperature will be cooler for the high temperature, we look like we'll see heat index values near 105 once again mm. before rain chances really ramp up heading into the weekend. Again, the scratched record, the mm -hmm. scratch CD. Broken record, just put, just put it on repeat. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. All right. Mercy. Thank you. All right. Thanks. Welcome.